I was like, can we get the ones on tap? Draft, oat milk draft, iced latte. I that can't believe that worked out. So interestingly difficult to get that appointment. You are just something else, girl. All in all, pretty great. Yeah. And I was like, no, 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 we just want, want the, the oat milk iced oat, coffee. Yeah. Pancakes, syrup. I like that. That's another type of syrup. This is called date syrup. It's organic date syrup. It's spicy? No, it's not spicy. And this is what kind of syrup? Maple. maple. And where's maple syrup from? Where are we going this week? Can Canada. Yeah, that's where the syrup's from. It's our last morning in the Hamptons. We've had a good run here. But we are leaving today. We're leaving. We're going, where are we going? Where does Preston live? New York City. That's right. We're going to New York and then we're going to Canada to visit the fam. Preston, did you have a good time in the Hamptons? Yeah? What was your favorite part of this summer so far? Was it getting better at swimming? We swam a lot, right? Yeah. Did you see fish and turtles and... Shrike. You saw a shark? Yeah, down there. In the pool? There was a shark in the pool, man? What? Are you sure? Yeah, I see that shark. What? I don't think there was a shark in the pool. No. I was asking Preston what his favorite part of the summer was so far. What did you say? Yeah, what was your favorite part of the summer? He said swimming, he saw a shark in the pool. What? <laughs> really? Did you see a shark in the pool? Cheers. No, wait, what? You want to cheers? What? Wait, what? Make sure you chew. I got about an hour and a half. By the way, we have been eating off the lettuce grow here. Tomatoes are about to be booming. Should we take some lettuce back to the city? Yeah. I'm going to eat it now. You're going to eat it now? What? In my morning coffee. Our renters have a daughter the same age as Preston, which is incredible. So we just leave all the toys, the strollers, the cribs. It's pretty much the best case scenario. And we're gonna leave her a special little new toy from Preston. Right now I need the morning gas. All right, just been running around my head cut off trying to get all this property organized but it is looking good I was thinking it's so funny I get this house so dialed in for the renters like I'm tightening toilet paper holders just so they don't angle down a bit and I'm like judging everything but I've been living with all these things kind of broken or misplaced and then they're forcing me I mean, not forcing me, but I'm forcing myself to like make sure it's like great when they check in. But why don't I do this right when I arrive? Why don't I make it the best I possibly can? But, you know, you just kind of get busy with life, kids. Suddenly it all catches up and none of it is happening. So another perk of renting, not only the income you get from it, which is incredible. It also forces us to get the house in perfect shape and do upgrades and make sure everyone's feeling good about it. Oh, just remembered I need to put these chairs away. Oh. Oh. <laughs> she doesn't want to leave. She doesn't want to leave either. But it's been an absolutely amazing two months here. We've never ever been to our house in July before nice that we got to use it it is really nice to be here in the summer I see why the renters love it but whew, it's hot but I really am gonna miss is that cold plunge right there every day don't really know how to replace that in my life definitely don't have one in the city and the places that have the cold plunges are very expensive just to take a dip in some cold water, so. 
gotta get back out here more in September. Fortunate to have this house. Really is a great time. We have so many memories. It's creating so many more. And look at, it's weird. The hydrangeas took till August to bloom. Usually they come in July. But they are looking good. And these things are tall. Like, I'm 5'11". These things are taller than me, which is crazy. I miss this place. What I did do yesterday is do all sorts of measurements because I've got, well, we're working on a back renovation, the granny suite, we're calling it. I got two big additions I want to do after that. One is I'm going to do this 25 to 30 foot glassed in dining area off the side of the house here and then a three car garage over there coming back 2025. So stay tuned for that. I'll share some of the designs, renderings as we go. Excited about that because this little beat up old step is gross. All right, Mom, are we good? I think so. Mm. Got so, a packed car in here. Ooh, I've got a baby in here. Okay, you ready for your ride? Okay, we'll see so. you soon, okay? All right. That's it, P. Bagels? Yeah, we're gonna get bagels. Now? Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. We're gonna say bye to the house. Can we wave bye to the house? Bye, house. See you in September. See you in September, house. Dropping the car off at storage. That was our season in Old Waggy, right? Do you like Old Waggy? Or do you love Old Waggy? I love Old Waggy. Yeah, Old Waggy's great. It's Ray Hill's real parenting life. We had to pull over because Preston had to pee on the side of the road in the city. Mama's breastfeeding in the car. <laughs> We're trying to make it home, but you know, can only go so far. Woo! Spicy out here. Another news, I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but we put running boards on the Defender. I think it's looking pretty good now. Gave it another little element. We charged like 800 bucks, plus another 800 to install at Land Rover. So I got these bad boys on Amazon. And also the ones that Defender, the ones that Land Rover are rubber. These are painted black to match. It's black. Just has a nice little detail. Gives it like a nice low profile. Just the little things, you know? Make a car guy happy. Are you done feeding now, baby Claude? Just had the biggest burp. You had a big burp? Okay, let's get you back in. And let's go home. We're 10 minutes away. We almost made it. What do you think? He looks so cute. Can you put her back in your seat? Yeah, I'll put her back in. Am I your papa? Am I your papa? Am I your papa? Ready? Let's do it. Let's go. All right, we got home last night after a hectic day of travel. As you saw, I did some serious unpacking. Still working on it, but man, we had so many bags. The amount of stuff you accumulate just going somewhere for a couple weeks. Anyway, this is kind of a little window into what our world really looks like right now. And I'm big organization, so this just crushes me. But we're getting there. We have this great gray cashmere headboard. It's also a tan cashmere wall, by the way. And then this wood gray um, bed frame on the side. So I've always had a white sheet set, but I thought it'd be kind of cool to try to gray one. So Brooklinen came through. And if you guys don't know Brooklinen, they are a great, high quality, well-priced bedding company. I've been using them for years. We've been using them for years. We've been sleeping in them for years. Um, so we got the classic bundle. This is the pillowcase, the 
core sheet set and under the duvet cover. So I'm gonna change this bed up and see how it flows. First, the core sheet set. <laughs> Mama, come upstairs. Mama, come upstairs. I think this is looking pretty good. I think this looks pretty cool. What do you think? What do you what think? Do you think? <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Okay. What do you think? <laughs> Preston, I fluffed up the bed and what did you do? I went like this. And then what did Preston do? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it looks good. Oh, this is nice. Preston, see this button? Can you press this button? Wow. Once, yep. Yeah. And go to the other side and do the same thing. Good and then job. can you turn the gray one off? The gray switch? Yeah, turn it off. Wow. Jockey. Moody, Preston. I kind of like the gray mm, sheet. I like them a lot. Yeah. What do you think, Mr. P? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> you say, it's good vibes in here. <laughs> say, good vibes. Good vibes. Yeah, it looks nice. All right, we did it. One, two, oh. three. Oh. <laughs> Jump. No, on the bed. On the no bed. more monkeys jumping on the... Jump on the bed. Yeah, jump up and down. Jump, jump. Hey. <laughs> and there it is. Our new Brooklyn in bed. Use my code. Your body will thank you. Your sleep will thank you. It's crazy. Cheers. Cheers. But our new favorite spot is called Cabra. A la cabra. And they do these oat milk draft lattes. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> You're like, we'll take. I was like, can we get the ones on tap? And she says, cold brew? And I said, no, it's milk. And then I said, the oat milk one. And she goes, oh, it's called an uh, draft, oat milk draft ice latte. No, that's not what she said. <laughs> She's like, and then. Draft latte. Right? And I was like, no, 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 we just want, want the, the oat milk iced oat, coffee. Yeah. She's like, no, She's like, no. put on tap. Anyway, I haven't really shared with you guys, but it's been very difficult to get a birth certificate for baby Claude. Morning, baby Claude down there. That was tough. We just put it in this box at the hospital and hope to God that it's going to arrive. It didn't. So we had to make calls and calls and calls and calls and calls until they found it so we got that and then that was like a week ago and then they said six to nine weeks to get a passport and we're leaving for Muskoka tomorrow tomorrow so that was tough so we started talking to friends at dinners and someone recommended an expediter here and we were like good luck apparently I had to have someone who's like dying in another country to even get a note yeah but we got a cancellation for an appointment today, which is the day before we leave to Canada. And we are walking there now and it's supposed to be same day issue. So we're banking on it because we've had these tickets booked for a while to go to Canada to see the fam so everyone can meet baby Claude, my sister, her husband, our niece. My dad hasn't met Claude. She's already two months old. So here we go. We made it. Now we're waiting in line. Also, this is dad life. I got a leopard print backpack on. Mary so wanted the leopard print. <laughs> I got leopard print. We are four people away and the line is getting long. Okay, so update here. Look at baby Claude. We, oh. <laughs> okay, so update. We have left the passport office. We finished our appointment, and what time is it, do we think? Noon? 12.30 or 11.30? Yeah, it took us like an hour and a half. Took us like, hours. yeah, an hour and a half, two hours. 
completely different than last time around, right, baby quad? Yeah, because it was COVID, we couldn't leave the building. This is nice. I come back in four hours on my little scooter, pick up baby Claude's passport. And then we're on our way to Canada tomorrow. Yeah, but we gotta go pack. Yes. Right? You need to pack for the lake. You gotta get your swimsuits. You gotta get your looks. So cute. Yeah, we're excited. I that, can't believe that worked out. So interestingly difficult to get that appointment, but besides a bit of a hurry up and wait situation, all in all, Pretty great. Yeah, pretty painless. But not until we have it in hand, right, Baby Claude? Baby Claude didn't even make a sound while we were in there. Such a, a good little one. Not a peep. We love you. <laughs> <laughs> you looking right at the camera, BB? Get a quick mani petty. Just a buff, guys. You know, nail health. I'm serious, but I'd like to say we got this thing, and it is uh, woo pretty exciting. We're going to Canada tomorrow. Just talked to my mom, my niece. Everyone's super pumped. So. On we go. We just drove out to Brooklyn. Bush, wait, oh, sick shot. Look at you. Our friends at Palm Heights, Cayman Islands, as you've seen on these vlogs, opened a rooftop restaurant, pop up in Busher called Habibi. So we figured we're in the city. Oh, that was a dead rat. That's an old dead rat. The thing looked like. This is cool. Yeah. We are out of here. Hello, guys. How's it going? Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Welcome, welcome. Uh -huh. Members Club, and this is the pool. Whew. That's it. Our night is over. We're walking home. Woo. We're so tired, we gotta get to Canada at 7 a.m. Basically. Yeah. And we're not done packing. Nope. Because it was hectic in this passport. Sliding in a little manicure. Petty, how are your fingers looking? I did a whole shoot. Woo. Can I actually, I can show you a BTS of the shoot. BTS, and it's going in. <clears throat> wow, sick. You're so proud. I like it, it looks good. This and your hair looks my amazing. Idea. The you also got a haircut. Floor POV. You also got a haircut. I did get a haircut. It's looking great. Thank you, babe. You are just. Something else, girl. You're looking cool. I had to pump twice before we came <laughs> at 7.30 in the morning. Mom got a pump. We got a pack. Welcome. We have so much of it. We're traveling pretty... It's just I guess business. we are. This is tough. Get our morning coffees. You know it's such a yummy mix. Whoa! No! Yeah! No! No! You want them back in the bag? <laughs> okay. Put them back in the bag. Oh, uh, parenting. You don't like mixing them? Yeah. Okay. You like having just your pretzels? Yeah. Okay, my bad. Where did we make it to? Well, what's that? Canada. What's this little mark? I don't know, it's tiny, man. That's a seat up. Look, look behind it. Step down and look behind. There's another row of stairs. What? 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 Crazy, right? Crazy. Go, go. Crazy. Crazy. 
Daisy, go, go, go. This changes everything. We're on the side of the highway. This isn't good. This guy's going to have another driver that's close, and we are woo, on the highway. And then there's a tire down here. But this is pulled right out. It's broken. Sketchy.